Yeah. What's up guys, it's Nier here from x Play, so and today I'm going to be bringing you a real quick 100 plus gameplay that I got a couple hours ago. Um, I got it with the gold PDWs and silencer, fast mags, and drop. Um, this channel is with me and two other friends, Aussie and Polo. We are three pretty good players. Um, I do have GB experience. Aussie does not have GB experience, and Andy does. I mean, Polo does have a little bit of GB experience. So yeah, so we're just gonna talking about um, the channel. Well, we think of this. We're doing this for fun. I mean, yes, a lot of people are saying it now. We just haven't played enough. I mean, yes, we have played enough, but we really haven't played that much with each other. We just started playing with each other a couple, I don't know, months ago, to a year ago, through school. We met through school. And so we just all started playing together, and we all thought, well, we're really good players, so let's just make a YouTube channel and see how far we can get. Um, we can play here up real quick. Uh, it's a double swarm, 100 plus, with two dogs, and I'm running the usual kill streaks for 100 plus. Orbital dog swarm. Friendly UAV um, inbound. And running over the full team here. Uh, first two kids, uh, Dirty Cow and B Man Baseball, I think. Um, Orbital be set on stand. Channel is gonna hopefully pick up with this. We do have a couple subscribers. I hope we redneck. Can post this video and give me a couple subs because I we try really hard to get these gameplays and we put so much time and effort into this. I'm not lying, we do put time and effort and we are too bad at school. So yeah. standby. So the uh, gameplay it's he, my friends say it's too spawn trap. This is the way the spawn should be in Call of Duty. If you're, if you're gonna, if you get pushed back into a spawn trap, you deserve to get pushed back into a spawn trap. On all for three was the basically the game that said no more of that. It was in demolition, like on new do yeah, dome. So long as I played that game, once you destroyed one bomb and you started pushing up to their spawn, you couldn't go. They basically were in your spawn. They started spawning on their side. Did not really like it all, so that's why I didn't really play too much. Uh, Mono for three size. When we have a full team, we and you could spawn trap on CTF. I mean, like they would spawn right in front of you. I mean, it's actually not that hard to do. It was pretty easy. We did it basically all summer. So just to have fun, see how many miles we get over the summer. I mean. Mono for 3 was a joke of a game, so it wasn't really, um, that us, well, it was a joke of a game, so we didn't really play it as much, because anyone could do good in it, like, I mean anyone, my 10 year old sister could drop 20 kills in random circles in that game, it's not that hard to do. Up here I just get my dogs, and then I get my swarm from my, no, I get like one or two kills, Get my swarm and swarm away. Seen the run, and the reason why you, you should always run orbital with dogs and swarm. Your orbital gets assist every time someone gets a kill, and that is very helpful. And another thing, if you want to rank up fast. In regular game mode, it's not like young game instructor. A lot of people say you get a lot of XP from what you do. Um, that's where I used to rank up until I found this method. You run UAV, counter UAV, and orbital. Because every time you get a, every time you get UAV and counter UAV up or orbital, you get um, assist, and then you will get tons and tons of assist. Um, right here, the game the game ends because of theater. I don't really like theater, so it doesn't like me. So it just cuts out on me. And up here, this is where I get my hundred plus. I get my hundred plus like halfway through the overtime. Yes. Man team. We do make it go into overtime because we go for it. We're not too much of objective players. Well, I can play objective, but you know, no, everyone else just plays kill horror. Roll. Um, 
This hunter plus, I think, did not take a lot of skill. Charge. Understand, yes, it is a hunter plus. It does take. You do have to have kind of a little bit of skill to get a hunter plus. This game, but my dog, my swarm, and my orbital helped me just get my hunter plus. Yes, I did get a nuclear in this game, and most people that get a hundred pluses don't have it, don't get a nuclear. Um, which is kind of surprising because you're getting a hundred kills, you're gonna get on some kind of streak, get something. And I did, I did get a nuclear. Um, in the second half, and where the theater cut out. So yeah, that's about it, guys. I'm gonna end my comments right here. If you guys want to come check out the channel, I'll have it. The link in the description below. Um, we Friendly try to post daily, but with school it's kind of hard. So we might post, I don't know, sometimes like two to three times a week. Maybe we might post all week if we have time. Like if it's a slow week at school, we won't post a lot. Like midterms are coming up with us for us, so we're not going to be able to post as much. Um, so, yeah, that's it, guys. Um, come check out the channel. And I will talk to you guys later. Kill confirmed. On the move. Charge is set. Hostile UAV above. Friendly UAV inbound. 